Oh, hey, have I got a script for you. This thing is grade A pure gold. It's like Return of the Living Dead meets Bridges of Madison County, only better. Close your eyes and picture this. A top secret military aircraft carrying top secret cargo fucking explodes in midair after an engine malfunction. And the debris rains down over a secluded wheat farm in the middle of nowhere. What's this top secret cargo, you ask? Dead soldiers that have been reanimated into zombie super soldiers. The echoing explosion wakes up the missus, and she's like, Oh, honey, what was that? You need to go outside. I'll check it out. But that's a bad idea, because our super soldier zombies are ready for war. Ah, the zombies in my fucking field. This farmer is now the last line of defense to prevent a global, 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 zombie, 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 outbreak, outbreak, outbreak. Run! I'll take care of this shit! It's the middle of middle America. Zombies on the doorstep. Our farmers got like mysterious containers to shoot up. Let's call them mutation stations. It's a foggy night, and the... Uh, make it a clear night. The lens flares will look much better. Yeah, I love it. Your cinematic signature is gonna be all over this. stations would have glass capsules filled with zombie-making goo. I can just imagine our hero busting open that glass with some bullets. Ah! It's so fucking badass.
our heroes at the flaming wreckage. <gasps> What's that? It's a zombie with its skull opened, brain exposed, and it's leaking toxic goo. Hmm, that's gross. <laughs> you want me to explain what happens when our hero headshots him? <laughs> nah, I'm good. Our hero gets to the shed and has to deal with more zombies. Mm, we need a set piece here. It's not a shed, it's where they store gas. Yeah, that is the kind of mainstreamness that this idea needs. It's the middle of middle America. Zombies on the doorstep. Our farmers got like mysterious containers to shoot up. Let's call them mutation stations. It's a foggy night and the- uh, Make it a clear night. The lens flares will look much better. Yeah, I love it. Your cinematic signature is gonna be all over this. <laughs> And these mutation stations would have glass capsules filled with zombie-making goo. I can just imagine our hero busting open that glass with some bullets. Ah! It's so fucking badass. hero gets to the shed and has to deal with more zombies. Mm, we need a set piece here. It's not a shed, it's where they store gas. Yeah, that is the kind of mainstreamness that this idea needs.
our heroes at the flaming wreckage. <gasps> What's that? It's a zombie with its skull opened, brain exposed, and it's leaking toxic goo. Hmm, that's gross. <laughs> you want me to explain what happens when our hero headshots him? <laughs> nah, I'm good. And then our hero finds a super shotgun. I think of the boomstick from Army of Darkness, but like with more boom. Woods, the mysterious coup is making dead dogs come back to life. No, audiences will not like the idea of dead dogs. Did I say dead dogs? I mean, I mean like zombie wolves. A zombie, you get a zombie, you get a zombie, everybody get zombies.
extraterrestrials. Yeah, so, so I know you did similar stuff in that TV show, but imagine it was done better. I won awards for that show. And you lost a bunch. Hmm, you know what? I'm gonna pass. Your idea was pretty basic. I'm the one responsible for the pizzazz. <laughs> Come on!